Let's take a look how to make this underground grungy and noisy effect here in Photoshop. I'm gonna go with this model as a reference, and this is my artboard size. Let's go to the layer with the model, or right click on it, and select Convert a Smart Object. Also rename it, and then I'm gonna go to the filter, and let's go to Noise, and select Add Noise. Here I'm gonna increase the noise to 45, make sure to uncheck monochrome, click OK, and I'm gonna go back to the filter, let's go to Blur, and let's go and select Gaussian Blur. Here we're gonna make the noise a little bit more blurry, so we're gonna go here to the radius and I'm gonna decrease it to 0.8. Let's click OK. Then let's go to the filter, filter gallery. Here we're gonna need to open up the sketch and let's select the torn edges. And first we're gonna go here to the smoothness and increase it, so this is going to increase the contrast nice and high. And I'm gonna go with 14. Let's go to contrast, increase it. I'm gonna go all the way up. 21 and also you can adjust the image balance and I'm going to decrease it a little bit more 25 click OK I'm also going to need to add a little bit more blurriness here and let's go back to the filter blur select Gaussian blur again this time I'm going to go with 0 0.3 click OK let's go to the adjustments and select the hue saturation here we're gonna go to the lightness and I'm gonna decrease it to minus 25. Now let's go down here to the adjustments and here you can select the solid color. And I'm gonna select the black, click OK. Right click on the layer and let's go and select convert smart object. Also rename it as noise. And let's go to the filter again. Noise, add noise. And here make sure to select monochrome. It's gonna be on 45, click OK. And let's go to blend mode. And here we're gonna need to change it to screen. And that's how I make this underground grainy grungy effect here in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.